You got it. Good practice. <laughs> Did Aaron Wise going pro lead to you coming earlier or were you kind of thinking about doing that anyway? Um, yeah, it did have an influence on me. Yeah, um, yeah I didn't, I, I was also planning on it as well. Mm -hmm. um, and I felt like I, I needed to go to the next level in order to improve because I've had an extra year in, in uh, junior golf when, when do me as well. Has it gone even better than you hoped or is this kind of how you envisioned your first year? Going? Um, yeah, it has gone better than I hoped, but game-wise, I I feel like I am where I'm supposed to be, and I can still improve, obviously. Um, and performance-wise as well, I have been performing well to to a lot of other standards, but to me, I feel like I can perform a lot better. How are you feeling heading into your first nationals? I'm I'm just really excited. I just want to go out there and enjoy enjoy every moment of it. Casey was saying that maybe this team didn't play its best golf in Baton Rouge, but a chance now to make up for that uh, in Chicago. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, we didn't. We we had a few mess ups, but um, hopefully we can sharpen up going into the championship. What so, are the nerves like going into nationals? Does it compare to regionals, or more so, or less so? Um, not sure yet. Not. I don't know. Hasn't um, hit yet. Yeah, it hasn't hit yet. I, maybe when I get there, I'll feel it. What are some of the, have you played in some huge golf tournaments uh, in your junior level play? Um, yeah, I've played in a lot of AJJ Invitationals, those type of tournaments, um, national tournaments, Sage Valley Invitational. Um, I also played in the Junior Ryder Cup, which was really exciting as well. And that was probably one of the biggest stages I've played on. So, uh, yeah, I have. So when Oregon won it last year, did you watch it on the golf channel? Yeah, or how I did. did. You yeah, I was excited, yeah. I watched it. it was <laughs> what fun. was kind of your gut reaction when, when Raza hit that putt. Yeah, I mean, when they when they actually won it, I was really I was actually kind of surprised. You know, like yeah. they kind of seemed like the underdogs, even though they were we were at the home course, because um, they've never won a national championship, and I wanted to be the first one on the team. <laughs> you know, to be on the team. But um, hopefully, we can do it again this year. Casey has said to his surprise, this team might be just as good or even better. Um, what does that say, I guess, about this team going to the Nationals? Yeah, I mean, I think that if we all play solid golf like well, like we expect to, then I think we are definitely better than last year. Um, I think we're more stacked and obviously have Wyndham. And, yeah. yeah so. Do you draw off Wyndham at all? I mean, he's, he's the senior leader on this team. What do you take from him? Um, I think just his maturity and knowledge of, of the game and skill. Um, I, I'm a lot of I'm a really feel player, and he he's uh, he's kind of the opposite of me. So um, we've kind of I guess gone back and forth in that, and he's taught me a lot of tech, technical stuff about the game, which has really helped. So, what do you mean when you say a feel player? Um, I I don't really care about mechanics really at all. Um, just kind of where the ball goes and how how I make it go there mm -hmm. is really how I play the game. So. So he's more into like the technical side mm -hmm. of it, yeah. making everything yeah. mechanically yeah. sound. Yeah. yeah, which works for him, obviously. Does he say like, man, what? Do you, like, you're all messed up. How are you doing this? <laughs> yeah, kind of sometimes, but no. Um, really, just more with sharpening technique. Um, there's like, especially in short game, there's a lot of um, a lot of technique involved, not only feel, and he's helped me a lot with that. 